Hey love, so this video is going to be something really quick. Please excuse my voice because it is a little hoarse. So this is why as um, wigs and this is their 360 lace front. Okay, so you guys do see there are three combs in this unit and an adjustable strap and it is silky straight, 180% density and 20 inches tees. Okay, so the first thing you see me doing here is I am just going to place my pressed powder on the inside of the cap. That way it looks as natural as possible because I really don't want to do anything like bleach knots or tint them. You know, I just want to put it on straight out the box like I'm doing right now. So I do have on a wig cap underneath. I really do prefer these ones right here because they just make life so much easier. Also, your hair is able to breathe. Your scalp is able to breathe. So I do like the fishnet wig caps. Now, as you guys see, I'm just going to go ahead and cut some of these baby hairs in the unit because I really don't like them too long. You know, I'm not really a big, huge fan of baby hairs, or maybe somewhat I am. I could be lying, but I just really don't like a lot. I don't like a lot of them, and I really don't like them super long. So, how I tame my baby hairs is I will be applying some of my herbal essence mousse just around the edges, so that way I don't have to just use a whole bunch of gel. I will be using some gel, which is one of my favorites, and you guys will see that in a minute but first I want to situate the hair a little bit here you know make me some baby hairs a little part you know comb it in as you guys see the lace is um, very light it's more or less like a light brown now I want to say like it was pre tweezed because I don't believe like the hairline is excuse me pre plucked but it does look as natural as possible plus you know we always have to tweak stuff even with the pre plucked lace wigs we do have to you know tweak them so I did use my flat iron or rather my curling barrel just to lay the hair down in the middle a little bit and I'm just gonna put a middle part for right now because I am going to do something a little bit different with it but being that it's out straight out the box I do um, kind of like put a middle part in it just to style it a little bit only because I like my side part to be a little bit um, with some height in it and so when it's straight out the box this is the easiest way for me to do it is to kind of like make a middle part and kind of like situate it and then you'll see me in a few minutes I'll flip it over but first I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use the got to be uh, excuse me not the got to be but the gorilla snot gel and I wasn't ever like a huge fan of it but I still am like getting used to the color but I love the holes of it it's extremely well it doesn't flake up it doesn't like you know get all crusty so that's why I really prefer the gorilla snot gel so I'm just brushing the baby hairs up just to kind of like camouflage that lace and as you guys see, this is where I'm going to go ahead and just do my parting. This is a right-sided part. And like I said, I do make a part in the middle first when it's straight out the box. And then I'll do my side part, especially if I want the part or the volume of the hair to be a little bit more heightened. So this just allows my hair to give it a little bit of height. So now to finish off these baby hairs, I really don't want them to look too much like baby hairs, but more or less like they're just kind of like hairs, wispy, kind of like growing out of my scalp, kind of like type thing, you know, kind of like jazzed up. I really just don't like them too like gel down to my forehead or my hairline too much. So that is the reason why I kind of like brushed them up. Now this hair is super soft, but it's also very, very affordable. As you guys can see right here, I'm going to just go ahead and do some styling with it. And I'm just going to use my favorite curling barrel, which is the 8-in-1 um, curling barrel system from Irresistible Me. Like I was saying, it is 180% density. It is 20 inches. You can get it longer or short, shorter. It's up to your preference. It is super affordable. So that's one thing that's really important for those of you guys who don't want to spend a lot of money, but you still want that really nice glamorous hair, I would definitely check them out. This is the first wig review that I've ever done for them, which is YS Wigs, but it does come pretty fast. You know, DHL does deliver the units, and also they do have like a huge variety of wigs on their website. So I would suggest, you know, giving them a look checking them out the wig for the most part was you know super easy to style right here you guys have seen me style some wigs a lot i was more or less trying to go for like a kind of like waved kind of look something a little bit tossed or something a little bit sloppy nothing like really glamorous but if you are going for that glamorous look then you definitely can style this hair up and do a lot of different things with it because it is a 360 which means you can put it in an up to a ponytail you know there's so many different endless styles that you can do with the 360 versus a lace front me i just prefer them all i do like 360s i do like lace fronts and i do like full waist full lace wigs so on the website of ys wigs they do have all three versions so if you guys like one particular style or version 
of a lace wig you can definitely check them out like i was saying they are affordable as heck so that's one thing that i do like i don't really think that you should spend a lot of money on a wig because hey it's just hair i mean hey you can get a really nice unit for half the price of something really expensive so now that i went ahead and finished styling i'm just going to go ahead and just use some of my pressed powder you know kind of like fluff the hair up use some baby powder or not baby powder but pressed powder on my face because i am looking a little bit of pale right here kind of like jazz myself up you know finish the video along with that i'm gonna go and sparkle my lips up a little bit you know i don't really like too much color and besides it was super late when i was editing this video excuse me recording this video it's probably like 12 o'clock at night so you know but for the most part the hair is super cute it's long you know it's just a natural color so you know there's a lot of things that you can do with it but me right now i do think like this style is cute because it's very loose but i thought i would just do something totally different because for me in the summertime when it gets hot out here i don't like a lot of hair on my face or on my shoulder so as you guys see right here i'm going to take the hair and i love doing like these little kind of like pin up bouffants or what have you nothing too crazy but just something that'll keep it out of my face and still look cute and keep me kind of cool so that's what I'm talking about when you have like the 360s you can do like endless styles you can definitely pull the rest of your hair up if you wanted to but for me I love like these little like pin up hair styles because I just stay super cool in the heat plus it kind of looks cute and it's very flowy and tousled you know it depends on what you have on and yes you guys so I pinned up both sides and this is the final finished look for me I hope you guys enjoyed this video all of the information and coupon codes will be down below for YS wigs so on that note stay deep and deep delicious make sure you rate comment subscribe thumbs this video up share with all your friends and family on social media let me know what you think i love you guys and i'll see you in a soon to come video bye